Good morning. Happy Monday. Meteorologist John Hamanuk with Empire Weather. Today is June 20th, 2022, and this is your agriculture briefing for the morning. It is a pleasant, for now, and dry morning across a large majority of the Ag Belt, but warming up quite quickly and becoming very hot throughout the afternoon across a large majority of the northern plains, central plains, and even parts of the Ohio Valley. We have some showers and storms here across the Dakotas. Those will be a focus as we move into the next couple of hours and into this afternoon and into the evening. But the focus first will be the heat. Let's look at the forecast for this afternoon. And you can see the National Weather Service forecasting the development of widespread real field temperatures over 100. Upper 90s pretty much everywhere from central South Dakota, Nebraska, Kansas, and Oklahoma and Texas eastward including much of Minnesota and Iowa, as well as parts of Wisconsin later this afternoon, feeling like 106 degrees in parts of northwestern Iowa. The actual temperatures will challenge records as well. Actual temperatures in the upper 90s across a large majority of the northern plains, including parts of Minnesota, where daily record highs are forecast by the National Weather Service. And again, those real field temperatures, what it actually feels like out there this afternoon, going to be even more impressive as we watch this warm up through the afternoon with temperatures in the feeling like several degrees above 100 in a large majority of these areas. A couple of uh, other impacts for field work today. We can watch the frontal boundary here that develops throughout the Dakotas and the Central Plains and southerly winds really pumping this afternoon. Models forecasting wind gusts uh, above 25 miles an hour at times. These are the sustained wind speeds on some guidance with 15 to 25 mile an hour winds across parts of Kansas, Nebraska, even spreading into parts of Minnesota and Iowa. So despite the warmth and the heat, it's not very calm out there. It's also quite windy throughout this afternoon. Storm Prediction Center is forecasting the development of showers and thunderstorms later today. There's that level two out of five risk right here, slight risk in yellow, and some storms possible surrounding that as well. But this is the focus region for those showers and storms. If we look at the latest model guidance, it actually lines up pretty well with that. Here's the latest uh, high resolution models. This is simulated radar at 4 p.m. and you can see those showers and storms developing throughout the Dakotas. These will gradually organize and shift eastward uh, with heavy rainfall possible in parts of the eastern Dakotas as well as western Minnesota tonight. So this is valid at 10 p.m. It's a late show today, but these storms could produce strong winds, large hail, and very heavy rain. So keep an eye on that in the central and eastern Dakotas and western Minnesota. Have a way to get weather warnings and have a plan in place for these strong storms later this afternoon. Again, the main story today is the heat. Very, very hot across parts of the upper Midwest and Plains and warm even in the Ohio Valley. But the Ohio Valley is definitely the winner today. If we look at the wind speeds and the forecast we talked about, it's actually pretty calm. They're in that center of that ridging, so it's not too bad this afternoon. Temperatures in the 80s and relatively calm winds. Rough day for the Plains with those southerly winds really gusting. And as we mentioned, those uh, daily record temperatures expected this afternoon in the upper 90s with those real field temperatures well warmer than that, approaching 105 degrees in a large majority of the northern plains later today. We will have a lot more for you as we go through the day. Some critical updates to the forecast in the medium and long range as well as we head towards the uh, very, very important first and second week of July. For now, grab some coffee. Have a great morning. Take care, guys.